Okay, you guys, what is up? The King of Lightning is here today to do Toriko Chapter 205 review. Now, this week's Chapter Toriko is a very simple chapter, so the review should be quick. And also, the reason why I want to do this chapter fairly quick too, this review fairly quick, is because right now, like, I have a cold, and my speaking ability right now is, uh, I like an all-time low. Like, it, like, my throat right now. My throat is, like, on some serious... It's like someone stabbed me in the fucking throat. So, I'm like, yo, I've been drinking orange juice all day long. So, I mean, hopefully by tomorrow I'll be, uh, you know, better. But as of right now, I'm gonna keep this, you know, like, no real, you know, no real ecstatic, happy moments. You know, I'm gonna keep it, you know, nice, mellow, smooth. Because if I go and I start yelling and start saying the yo yeah! and all that shit... See, like, right there, like, like right, <laughs> right there, that did not feel good at all. So, I do apologize, but that's the way life is. Sometimes you get sick. So, I'm sick, but, you know, OJ, do me justice, you know, do me justice, and, you know, I'm I'm better. And plus, I'm I'm, I'm taking some pills, too, you know, some, some Tylenol, so I'm good. But uh, that being said, this week's Chapter Torico, it was okay. Um, it was more of a setup chapter. It, it was a setup for next week's chapter. Because what we're seeing here is that the Kings are getting their second win. And their second win is in the form of their hunger. And of their curiosity of how the four beasts would taste. Because what happens here is that we see Toriko. And and this chapter view, no real summary. But we're seeing Toriko. And Toriko's on the ground. And his stomach starts to growl, and as does and as does the stomachs of the four of the kings. They all start to growl and shit. And what happens here is that Toriko explains to us that Ichirayu, or um, you know, his master, before he sent them out to go take on the four beasts, he states that every like 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 the more damage they deal to the four beasts, then the more delicious the meat becomes. So maybe that's the reason why. Maybe maybe that's the reason why uh, the four beasts' capture level keeps on raising because they're dealing a lot of damage to it, and in return, its muscles start to create these amino acids. They start to develop, and then they start, to, and then and then they start to, to become stronger, and thus the meat becomes more delicious. So it's kind of like a weird adverse effect here. But basically, in order to kill the four beasts. You, you, you need to deal a great deal of damage at once. And if you do anything less, then it will only get stronger. But in return, that, that increase in strength equals to more delicious meat. So they're like, you know what? I really want to eat the four beasts right now. Like everyone, we have uh, Zebra, Coco, Torigo, even Sunny. They're like, yeah. Like all the songs are ground and shit. Like, yeah, yeah, yeah. We want to eat the four beasts. Like, we are hungry. <coughs> now, <coughs> what happens here is that the four beasts walks in, you know, big, big as fuck. Big as fuck. I mean, it's like, it's huge. It's like, and like, just, just big as fuck. And what happens is that Zebra, very impressive. Because the four beasts all of a sudden breathes in, just sucks in, shoots, shoots an air cannon. But they dodge the air cannon by Zebra using his jet. Like he, like he makes that like that flying jet like barrier type thing, and then they cruise through the sky, and then they wind up, uh, and then they wind up running away or escaping this uh, this uh, breath cannon. And what happens here is that the four kings, they are now in a situation where they're low on power and they need a way to deal a massive amount of damage to the four beasts. And apparently, and this, in my opinion, is, is a little bit too convenient, but then again, it makes sense because they were trained underneath the same master, and thus this master would teach them moves where they can utilize together as a team, as a unit. It makes sense. It is convenient, but, you know, it makes sense. <clears throat> and what happens is that this is a secret art where the kings will combine their power together and then this and then this combined this combined power will enforce one big attack. And the thing here is that, and Zebra states that this attack they need to synchronize their appetites and their spirits. 
So, I mean, I mean, obviously it's Toriko, and something always, always has to relate to food in some way, shape, and form. So their appetites, you know, meaning their urge to eat something and their spirits, their drive to try, their drive to try and, and, and eat that particular thing, they have to be in sync. And according to the rest of them, Zebra is always the least one in sync, which makes fucking sense. Because Zebra is a fucking, he is like a lone wolf. He is a lone soldier. He is the guy by himself facing 50, facing 50,000 dudes. It is Zebra. So, but you know, they're going to try and actually make this shit work. Because we see a flashback scene, like a little panel in like the bottom of the corner. And what we see here is that we see Toriko, Coco, Sonny, and Zebra as kids. And they're trying it with their kids. Or, well, not kids, but like much younger. Like, you know, 14, 16, around that age. And it didn't work. And then it... It didn't work then, but now that they have, now that they are stronger, they have the food honor, they have all this training process done. They can probably get this team attack off. Now the question is, what type of attack this is going to be? I'm not too sure. Will it be a beam, a shockwave, or some kind of weird like creature comes out, like a you know you know like a four combo punch or something of that nature? We're not too sure. Or it may take their elements, you know, like the sound, the hair, the poison, and the cookie punch, and may combine them into one epic attack. Who knows? But we'll see either next week or the week or, or the week after. And what happens here is that the kings are not preparing their their secret combo attack, but the four BC sees this shit, starts to breathe in once more for that breath attack, and they're like, "Fuck, we're kind of screwed here." But bam, animal beast. That's right, animal partners. Terry, Quinn, and Kiss. What surprised me is that Kiss, because he... Kiss is a crow. I mean, I think uh, he's like part of the king crow species. And honestly, in, in in comparison to Terry, who is a battle wolf, and Quinn, a mother snake, I don't see Kiss being, you know, on that same level. Like, that's just me. I mean, maybe you guys see it, but I, I don't really see it, because Kiss is cool. But I don't think he I don't think he's, you know, battle wolf level. I mean that's uh that's pushing it. That's that's really pushing it. But basically, what happens here is that Kiss, Quinn, and Terry, they go in there, and then they're gonna stall the four beasts for a period of time so the kings can set up their team combo secret art attack. And that right there is the and that right there is the end of the chapter. So overall, again the chapter it is okay. It's mainly set up, but the pacing was good. But like I said before, it's mainly set up for next week's chapter. And the whole entire team combo thing, even, even though it makes sense, it makes a lot of sense. It is convenient. I mean, the thing about this is that I was, I was hoping that we would see, you know, Mansum or Tepe, you know, go in there and assist them in some way, shape, and form. Because I'm pretty sure that Mansum is still stronger than any of the four Emily Kings. Uh, yeah, yeah, I'm, I'm pretty sure he is. But... I mean, then again, you know, it is their job. You know, Ichiraiu assigned the kings with the duty to take down the four beasts. That is their duty. So, and this also, of course, is their test before they go into the gourmet world. So, but overall, again, okay chapter. Uh, pacing was good, but, you know, again, it was more of a setup chapter. Um, the anime, I mean, the, the drawing style usually, you know, it's, it's good. Basically, everything was good. It's just that... The chapter itself was a lot of setup. So, with that being said, King Lightning, be sure to rate, comment, and subscribe as always. And I'm signing out. Peace. Have a nice day.